Hello there and welcome back to the channel. So here with another Stop Profound Destroyer video. On today's video, guys, it is Saturday. And because it's Saturday, I'm going to be doing my Team War battles for the Kenny crew. As you can see, um, right now we have a sort of normal bracket. No particular, you know, big whale teams in, in that bracket. Sitting at 116 on the, on the Silver League. Number two, number four, number two, number three, and number four. So we, you know, that's sort of our normal right now most of those number threes and number fours were weeks that we had a bunch of uh very hard teams so one thing that you can see here in terms of our deck we have just on many moons we have mr hankey we have pirate ship timmy we have who can Clyde, we have the visitors we have auto storm we have deck and butters awesome all uh, Pirate Ike, we have Sharon, we have Marcus, and then we have also Bolt. The idea for today is try to get as perfect of a score as we can. Right now sitting at number one, but it is very early. Um, it's just about two, one hour or two hours and 15 minutes since the event started. So I'm going to go ahead and hit battle and see how we end up doing the idea is that we want to try to get as close as a perfect score as we can i'm gonna go ahead and skip ahead see who we're gonna get so we're fighting against shatness from i think it's, it's something about kenny um and here we go like i like to start very slowly um because i saw sharon i'm gonna go ahead and do my son of many moons if he wastes his bolt on my Sun of Many Moons, which he did, then I'm going to go in. I can go and take out that uh, Sharon as quickly as I can. Normally, you want to save that bolt for Sharon. Sharon is crazy, crazy good on this particular challenge. Let me lower the volume a little bit. Uh, so Sharon is very, very good on this on this particular challenge. So you want to make sure that you use them as effectively and you save that bolt for her if possible. So that first sort of trade was did not end up being good for me. So you can see Arrowstorm just tickles Sharon. She can heal herself. Do not waste Arrowstorm on her. Um, and here we go. We're going to go in as hard as I can. Now those visitors, those visitors ended up being nasty, right? I should have used Arrowstorm. I think that warrants that one right there. Um, I thought that my Sharon could get out, but those visitors were, at least for him, were max level 5 visitors, right? So, that's why they were doing a little bit more damage and ended up surviving a little bit longer than mine did. So, so far, it's not looking very good. Um, it's not looking very good for us, but he, let's go ahead and give this a try. So, putting, putting, um... Deck and Butters in was also not the best of the ideas because there was nothing else to heal. I just needed an assassin and I put something that I did not need to put. So, so looking at the way he's playing this right now, I decided, you know, um, I'm going to start playing with Marcus. I'm going to do a sheep deck. Um, we're going to try to to waste him down like that, like that because I saw that every time he put his Sharon, he put his Sharon near the front line. So he was not healing his new kit, right? So now I'm going in, you know, psycho mode trying to, to get that, uh, um, that phone because I know I have the advantage. He has only a level 2 um, stand on mini moons. That stand on mini moons couldn't even kill pirate ship Timmy. And now with this, let's go. Either he bolts Sharon or he bolts down on Mini Moons. Either way, I have a strong play right now. So let's see what he ends up doing. Moon, give me power. Let's see what he ends up doing. So he ends up wasting his Arrow Storm. Um, and right now, I went in. I could have done Arrow Storm, but I decided against it. So here we go, guys. We have Mr. Hanky on the side. Sort of going in for for that hit, but he couldn't hit it. We have Sharon healing all those units up. She's boosted by the Mr. Hanky, and we managed to sneak in our deckhand butters for the win. So we got two of the three phones. That guarantees us at least 27 points, right? Because we have 25. Um, wait, is it 27? Oh my God, I, I I forgot how many. What is the 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 breakdown of the points. I know that for every win, I think for every win you get 15 and then for every loss that you avoid, let's take a quick peek. Oh, I cannot check because this is a recording. So we're going to go straight on to the second battle. 
see who we're going to be facing. And if I'm not mistaken, the other battles were a little bit more easier. Um, you know, sort of to, you know, to put it that way. Um, so let's see. So we have here um, Kenny Crew versus No Excuses. Um, my current uh, ELO rating is on it's 7,000, between 7,200 and 7,500, somewhere around that number. So um, FDR um, Polkiness, um, that's our enemy right now, our opponent. He did not put anything anything right away. He has a level one um, six element Randy. And once I saw that, and once I saw that he was putting in a level four um, <laughs> uh, Gizmo, I, I knew I knew I had it easy, right? Because all I need to do right now is just send my Aura Storm. And it's gonna kill most of those stuff, right? But I wanted to save. I I thought I could have killed. I thought I could have killed the um megatimi with the arrow storm and it did not end up so if had i know that i would have had just blasted them down with it with the stand of many moons um but n do not despair because we're still going strong here Sh putting sharon on the back line healing up that stand of many moons that level three awesome has no you know can he cannot do anything against that so we get our first spawn rather easily and we can heal up. Can we heal up that stun of many moons? Yes, we can. He has been healed. He takes the second phone right away. And now we're just going savage here. There's nothing else he can do. I know he knows that. I don't think he defends anything after this. And we managed to then squeeze our win within a minute and 30 seconds of the start. That is a perfect run with three phones defended and three uh, phones uh, defeated. So that's going to give us maximum points. All right. Perfect. So we're going to go now for the third phone. And if I'm not mistaken, I think the way they break down, every win nets you 20 points. And then every every um, defeat that you avoid nets you 15 points. And then every phone that you take, take you know, gives you one point. So back there, we avoided a win, uh, a defeat. So that is 20 plus 15, which is 35, and we got 30, 36 points on that first one. And then we got, um, we're going to get here 38 points on the second one because we managed to get all three phones, assuming that we don't lose anymore. So here we go on the third battle, Dark Knight from Equipo Argentino, uh, sitting at a 3,236. 3, um, I know, again, that I'm going to have an easy time, right, if I don't mess up. Um, so here we go. He's level three awesome versus my level four awesome. Uh, right there. I have an advantage. I'm just going to let him get close before I do anything else. I'm, I think I even waste my freeze. Maybe I don't, I don't waste it. Here we go. So putting in, um, stand mini moons, another team that decided to pick Gizmo. I, I'm not sure why. I mean, with our storm on the board, why would you pick a car that's so weak? Anyways. We go ahead and we blast with Stano Mini Moons. We get all the Gizmo Eyes out. We take a huge chunk of program stun out. And right now, Osomo is hitting my Osomo. So the, my Stano Mini Moons is actually pretty healthy. A level one Stano Mini Moons. Again, um, pretty pretty easy opponent. I mean, we're overwhelming, overwhelming, overwhelming. Oh my God, that word cannot come out. You know the word I'm trying to say. Um, with with our units, so um, right now we can just heal our Asomo. I'm gonna go ahead and bolt that Sharon, get her out of the way, and that's gonna be pretty much it for that battle. That will ensure that we will get another perfect score on this on this on this match, um, and in just a few more seconds, we're gonna take that phone out. Deccan Butters dies. He's going to heal uh, Marcus. Marcus is going to throw his little packet out. 121 points left. One hit from Marcus. And that's all she sang. We managed to get all our three wins in a fairly short amount of time. Um, the only moment that it was not a perfect score was that first battle against a harder player. 7,100. That was a very good, good game. So 
if I'm not mistaken, and if my math doesn't lie to me, we ended up with 112 points out of 114. I will take that any day of the week. So that pretty much settles it, guys. I'm doing battles early. I think pays off. Um, that's the current score. You know, we have three perfect scores so far and my score of 112. And that's all I have for you today, guys. Hope you uh, liked the video. Hope it gave you some ideas and some tips on how to do these battles. I will catch you later. So it's checking out.